returns to face his old club live on EA TV. Well, they say it never stops raining in Manchester. That is true today as we welcome you to the Etihad Stadium for this match. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Manchester City versus Nottingham Forest. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Foden. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Mateo Kovacic starts alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the oh, look at this, they must score! Oh, that's a fine save! It's a short one. Chance here. Determined defending. <laughs> Corner kick played in. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. And the advantage is with City. Well, as we look at the table, the opportunity very much there for the hosts to go top if they can win. Well, they've certainly had a great start to the season and they've played some really good football. Hopefully we get more of the same today. Origi. Gives it a go. Just couldn't get it through. And he's won the ball. Felipe. Now Origi. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, not a cross that will live long in the memory. Goal kick. And the referee now going back to deal with the earlier incident. A yellow card it's going to be. Rodri. Jeremy Doku. Holland. Holland. And a goal. Now they've broken through. 1 0 here. Well, this is worth watching again. Haaland beats the challenge with such ease, and then the finish is just as good from Haaland. He just strikes the ball with such power and accuracy. That's a wonderful goal. And back underway. 1 0 it is. And he saw the situation developing. Doku Walker and crossing towards the far post but it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it left the boot well there's been quite the focus on him coming into today's game up against his old club today he was always going to be front and centre and you have to say, there's been an awful lot of goodwill. Well, you're always a little nervous playing against your own team. You want to put in a good performance, and you certainly don't want the fans on your back. But he had many a good display in front of this crowd, and they haven't forgotten that. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Electing to shoot. 
And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. It's a promising attack launched by De Bruyne. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Nico Williams. Nicolas Dominguez. And room now out on the wing. Dangerous ball. Not the best clearance. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Good work from City to win back the ball. Well, not many would debate the point that Erling Haaland is a joy to watch whenever he's out there on the pitch. But what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, the stats tell you everything. He's a top-class striker. Even when he's having a quiet game, he can still pop up with a goal, as we may well see today. Getting forward. Well, that'll be a corner. A goal here would really change the complexion of this match. Who's going to get on the end of it? A decisive clearance it was. McKenna. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. But really sticking to their task defensively. So nearing the break and City hold the edge. Stuart, how about your critique of what they put into the game so far? Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. Origi. He's in here. Oh, he stopped it. Well, I thought that would be a goal, but what a save. Great reactions. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Half time, that will do it for the first half here at the Etihad. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Well, they have the ball once more. Nicolas Dominguez. Williams. Promising looking attack. Can he play it in? Oh, a moment of pure class! Had to catch it perfectly, and didn't he just? Well, here it is again. Just look at the quality of the cross. It's inch perfect, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Well, they needed that, and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Phil Foden. On to Holland. Crossing possibilities. Foden. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Well, that's how to outwit your opponent. It's got to be! It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Well, we always enjoy bringing you live action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up. It's Nottingham Forest facing Brentford.
and cutting it out. Origi. And he loves drifting in off the flank. Origi. Stopped a certain goal. A chance now with the corner. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Over it comes. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Can he do it to take the lead? Oh, blocked it! Clean challenge. Can he put them in front? Well, that's a really top-notch piece of defending. Alvarez. Released it nicely. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Nicolas Dominguez. Now Origi. Well, there it is. The visitors have completely dominated the game in the last 15 minutes and looked a real threat going forward. But they must take one of these chances while well, they're having this good period. But you do sense it's coming. City pushing forward with options available. Kovacic. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. look at this again to pick out this pass shows wonderful vision it's inch perfect and it makes the striker's job so easy all he has to do is make the right connection it's a lovely goal well underway again it's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand Origi well they're moving it around with real purpose here Can they make one of these passes count? Shaping to shoot and keeping it out. Well, a goal to let you know about in the Brentford game. Here's Alex Scott. It's a goal for Brentford. It's all even Stevens at 1 1 with 77 minutes played. Alex. Hold on. Well, he could have put it away again, but credit to the goalkeeper. Well, the way he's playing, he's surely going to get his second goal soon here. And time for the change now. Corner kick played in. Oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping. Well, pressure building, another corner. And this might not be the ideal situation for them. And a fine piece of goalkeeping, which keeps their hopes alive. Well, you're right, that keeps them in it. But can they find an equaliser? They need some urgency in their play. Well, a wild swing at the ball in the end. That was what it amounted to. <laughs> Origi. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Well, the final whistle soon to be sounded, but not quite yet. It's City with the lead. Stuart, how would you critique what you've seen from them? Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Some of their football has been excellent, but they're going to need to be resilient in these final few minutes to get their much-deserved victory. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. 
Here it is now, a substitution. Who can they pick out? And nodding it just over. Well, once he gets his head on it, that's a chance, I think. Rodri. Alvarez. And now Stones. Guardiol. On the ball, Ruben Dias. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Grealish. On the ball, Ruben Dias. Stones. Ruben Dias. Guardiol. And there goes the final whistle. A real sense of feel good for City fans everywhere. They take the three points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, it was a tight game. Both sides had their moments and chances, but overall, they just about shaded it. A well earned victory. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.